Hey guys, welcome to my page. So tonight we got a little bit different motor. Um, this is the Axial Flux motor. So if you see right here, the coils and the magnet are straight across from each other. Um, there are six coils and there's eight magnets, um, north, south, north, south, all the way around. And um, we have optical timing set up in here. You can see the magnet spinning. Uh, we have three optical circuits um, that are right here. This is my my MOSFET circuit that I've been using on all my projects. And um, so one, two, three. And uh, the output comes out straight off of the, the um, positively right here through the diodes. And then it's hooked up um, like a Bedini circuit with the series um, wire hooking from positive turns into negative on the output and um, yeah that's a normal circuit so uh, with this motor uh, everything's self-starting uh, we got the capacitor discharge circuit um, ready to go um, this one is is time to switch at 18 volts so 18 18 and a half it discharges into this battery standing at 1280 and then this is our primary battery 1298 and then we'll be able to see the amperage um, right here with this meter if we can there we go so we're going to give this a go you guys can see how it runs so here's the scope shot it's kind of hard to see with video it doesn't capture all of it because it's pretty quick. We're at uh, 400 milliamps. Cap discharge is it's going real slow right now. But right around six, seven amps. Um, typically higher, but the meter can't react that fast. So just keep bringing this thing up here. Alright, we're at full power. So let's see what the RPMs on this bad boy is. So we're right at 5,000. Scope shot. So this motor actually puts out quite a bit of power. If we do two amps out of this thing, that output just starts pulsing away pretty, pretty hard. So I hope you liked the video. This is K Energy Page. Don't forget to subscribe.